Ja. I think we have enough stuff. Well, I wanted to bring two surfboards and Billy wanted to bring all of them. So. It's supposed to be good. Need options. We are taking the trimaran over to where there's supposed to be really, really, really good waves. So hopefully we'll get some good ones. We got food, we got water, we got jetty, we got cameras. I think we're all set. Alright, we just dropped the mooring line. We're gonna go over to the fuel dock and get some fuel for the dinghy and just some extra fuel and water as well. We haven't put water in this since we were up in Massachusetts and then we winterized it from there. So we'll grab some fuel and water and then we'll be on our way. We're not going too far, but there is some wide open area up here and we're gonna be going into the wind a little bit. But um, we have enough room where we'll just tack into the wind as much as we can and sail a little bit. And then uh, once we get a little more narrow, then we will pull down the sails and motor the rest of the way. Sun's already going down a bit, but we have some time, so here we go. There she is, you guys. She's still for sale here in Stewart. We'll link her description below. She's looking good. She could be yours. It's gonna be a beautiful sunset. Alright, we got some water, gas, dinghy's all filled up. You ready? Roosevelt Bridge, Roosevelt Bridge, sailing vessel Adrenaline. Oops, I said the wrong boat. The Roosevelt Bridge, Captain. Roosevelt Bridge, when's your next opening, please? The next opening's at 5.30. Roger, we'll be standing by for that 5.30 opening. We are outbound. Copyright. We just pushed off the dock and the bridge is opening in five minutes or so, but the wind seems like it's dying, so we may be just going for a motor and instead of sailing. We'll see how it looks when we get to the other side of the bridge over here and we're able to raise the sails. It's gonna be a beautiful evening though. It's gonna get windy tomorrow out of the west. It's gonna be cooler weather and windy and there's gonna be some swell out there in the ocean. So we're gonna try to surf and um, we'll be right next to the spot where we'll, where we'll surf with the boat, which is gonna be really, really neat. So that's the plan. Come here, it's not because it's rough, it's just because there's no sides. Mm, look at that jacket. Look at that stylish jacket. What a good girl. Ready to go say Ali? Good girl. As you guys can see, we are bringing our old dinghy, our high field, the CL360, the big dinghy, compared to the one you saw in the video the other day, uh, our new roll up. And that's just because in a couple days we are going to do something insane behind this boat. It's going to be fun. So that's the plan at least. I can't tell you what yet, but you'll see. And we need a significant support boat for doing that. You'll see why. But that's why we're bringing it with us. Otherwise, it normally just stays on Adrenaline and that's Adrenaline's dinghy. And as you saw, Adrenaline is still on the mooring for sale uh, right back there bring it with us today. The other dinghy is at Sierra's parents right now in storage. We're keeping it nice and clean and protected while we're not using it yet. So we need something that can go fast and carry some people. All right, we're gonna try to sail. Sierra's raising the main sail here. Just watch that handle up there, love. I gotta turn into the wind for her a little more. It's getting dark, but we have some nav lights, so we're all good. All 
All right, engine is off and we are officially sailing. Sierra's just getting the jib out. Here we go, picking up speed. All right. Obviously the dinghy's gonna slow us way down, but that's all right, we're not going too far. So the wind is super light right now, like five knots, and we're kind of close hauled or close reaching into it in this enclosed body of water. It's a little bit shifty as well, um, but we're just about to turn the corner. We're gonna have to start tacking, and who knows, uh, as soon as the channel narrows a bit, we're gonna turn on the engine and just keep on cruising. Getting dark already, but we have our nav lights on, and uh, we can see pretty well. Well, we got to sail a little bit, but wind died and we're heading straight into it. But we're almost at the anchorage anyway, so uh, we're just about to turn in here and drop the hook for the night and wake up tomorrow and surf. We're all anchored up. We're just having ourselves a little dinner here. Nice little salad and uh, look at Jetty. You like it over there, huh? Obviously, you guys can hear the generator rumbling away out there. We're just making some hot water. So we gotta have a nice hot shower what? tonight. What? Generator. What? <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll see you guys in the morning. Yeah, we're just gonna chow down and then uh, hit the hay and wake up early and hopefully surf. So pray for waves and we'll see you guys in the morning. Well, last time we said we were gonna bring them to our movie night and then we forgot, but tonight we won't forget. Oh, you guys want to come to our movie night? All right, what are we watching? I don't know. We'll have to search Netflix. Any recommendations down there? Over there? In the comments? Send them our way. Good night, everybody. Hear it, I hear some waves. Here we go, the moment of truth. <laughs> All right. Are you sure you want to wait and make coffee? No, I think we have to get out there. So there's a reef out here actually that runs across that way and it blocks a lot of the power of the swell. You can see it breaking over there. Uh, but the more you run down this way, you can see, see it breaking out there as well. The more you run down this way, uh, the reef kind of stops and then the bigger swell can make its way in to shore and it does look a little bit better down, down this way. So there's a bunch of guys out down there and uh, I think that's where We'll probably just go grab something to eat real quick and then make our way down that way. 
Um, unless we see some more, there's some like longboard waves coming in here once in a while, so who knows, maybe we'll just do that. What is it? A dolphin. That's cool. There's like five of them up there. Oh and yeah. Like jumping in the air. They're playing with their food. Look at that. Wow. What are you doing? Making some breakfast. Or coffee, rather. We don't have a pot. In a pan? So tell me your plan for what the heck you're doing. Well, I'm boiling water in the stove, in the pan. And then um, I'm going to do the dishes quick. And then I'm going to put this cool French press thing that our friends at the Catamaran Supply got us for Christmas. And I'm going to pour the water into here with the coffee. And then hopefully I don't spill too much. And if I do, it's in the sink. And then we're gonna make some eggs. You gotta get creative when you need your coffee. We should just uh, get a pot. Here we go. Work like a charm. I probably put too much coffee in there. Hmm, maybe I didn't let it brew long enough. Aren't you supposed to like put it down halfway? Yeah, maybe. For all you people out there, life is so much simpler when you don't need coffee because we can be surfing already. Billy forgot his paddle on the bushes at the marina, so we're down aboard. <laughs> like a freaking, how much is that paddle? Like $300 paddle? I could have, I could ride the stand up paddle as a longboard. Hopefully someone picked up at the rain and gave it to the office. Hopefully. I don't know. But anyway, yeah, so I'll ride the longboard. Sarah's riding a shortboard. We're gonna we're just getting suited up, getting our sunblock on and gonna head over there now. JD's gonna guard the boat while we're over there, right? Inside. She's not trusted outside. She will jump ship. Alright, you ready? Ready! This water is cold in here. This seems colder than the ocean water. <laughs> All right, here we go. One of our buddies was here before, but he left and some of our other friends we know are here. Right now as well, they probably went down the beach a bit.
All right, you guys, we had an absolute blast. It's the next day now. It got so much better in the afternoon. It was so much fun. So it's the next day. We slept on the boat, pulled up anchor, and we're on our way to pick up some friends, and uh, we're gonna do something insane. If you guys wanna check it out, just make sure you're subscribed and the bell notification is clicked. Our next video is gonna be if it all goes to plan, it's going to be so crazy. So we hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thank you so much for watching as usual, and we'll see you next time.